Domine, labia mea peries, etos meum annunciabit laudem tuo. Domum Dei, decet sanctitudo. Sponsum Eus Christum Adoremus in Ea. Come, let us worship Christ, the Bridegroom of His Church. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the Rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hand. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God and we are His people, the flock He shepherds. Today listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did. In the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Forty years I endured that generation. I said there are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my way. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, the Bridegroom of His Church. Christ is made the sure foundation, Christ the head, the cornerstone, chosen of the Lord and precious, binding all the church in one. Holy Zion's help forever and her confidence alone. All that dedicated city, dearly loved of God on high, in exultant jubilation pours perpetual melody. God the one in three adoring in glad hymns eternally. To this temple where we call thee, come, O Lord of hosts, today. With thy wonted loving kindness, hear thy servants as they pray, and thy fullest benediction shed within its walls always. Here vouchsafe to all thy servants what they ask of thee to gain, what they gain from thee forever, with the blessed to retain, 
and hereafter in thy glory, evermore with thee to reign. Lord and honor to the Father, Lord and honor to the Son, Lord and honor to the Spirit, ever three and ever one, consubstantial, co-eternal, well unending ages run. Amen. Domus mea, Domus orationis vocabitur. My house will be called a house of prayer. O God, you are my God, for you I long, for you my soul is thirsting, my body pines for you. Like a dry, weary land without water So I gaze on you in the sanctuary To see your strength and your glory For your love is better than life My lips will speak your praise So I will bless you all my life In your name I will lift up my hand my soul shall be filled as with a banquet My mouth shall praise you with joy On my bed I remember you On you I muse through the night For you have been my help In the shadow of your wings I rejoice My soul clings to you Your right hand holds me fast Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Sicuterat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. My house will be called a house of prayer. Blessed are you, O Lord, in your holy temple. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, Bless the Lord, nights and days, bless the Lord, light and darkness, bless the Lord, lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord, praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord, everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord, seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. 
Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. Blessed are you, O Lord, in your holy temple. Praise the Lord in the assembly of his holy people. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion's sons exult in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand to deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Praise the Lord in the assembly of this holy people. Them I will bring to my holy mountain and make joyful in my house of prayer their holocausts and sacrifices will be acceptable on my altar for my house shall be called a house of prayer for all people The Lord is great beyond all telling. He exceeds all praise. The Lord is great beyond all telling. He exceeds all praise. In the city of our God on his holy mountain, he exceeds all praise. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. The Lord is great beyond all telling. He exceeds all praise. Zacchaeus, hurry down, I mean to stay with you today. He hurried down and welcomed Christ with joy. For this day salvation had come to his house. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old, that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, 
The dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Zacchaeus, hurry down, I mean to stay with you today. He hurried down and welcomed Christ with joy. For this day salvation had come to his house. We are living stones laid upon the cornerstone that is Christ. Let us pray to our all-powerful Father for his Son's beloved Church, professing our faith in her as we say, This is the house of God and the gate of heaven. Father, like the farmer, prune your vineyard, protect it and increase its yield until it extends before you throughout the world. This is the house of God and the gate of heaven. Eternal Shepherd, protect and increase your flock that all the sheep may be gathered into one flock under your Son, the one Shepherd. This is the house of God and the gate of heaven. All-powerful sower, plant the word in your field, that it may yield a hundredfold for your eternal harvest. This is the house of God and the gate of heaven. Wise builder, sanctify your home and your family, that the heavenly city, the new Jerusalem, your spouse, may appear before all as your glorious bride. This is the house of God and the gate of heaven. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O God, who from living and chosen stones prepare an eternal dwelling for your majesty, Increase in your church the grace you have bestowed, so that by new growth your faithful people may build up the heavenly Jerusalem. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat, et ab omni malo defendat, et ad vitam perducat eterna. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that, that we, we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. 